Hello! Welcome back to Suikoden! I still don't know really how to pronounce it. I think Suikoden is correct, but I don't know. Anyway, I did a little bit off screen. Uh, Tuda is still made of squish, but you know. I've gained a few levels. I have adjusted people's equipment, so. We all have the best I can get at the moment, as far as I'm aware. I wanted to. Uh, I wanted to actually give this blue ribbon to Tuda, but for whatever reason, she can't wear it. I don't know why. I guess it could be a he, actually. I keep calling it a she. Is it a he? It's got a very pointy chin. It is a child, though. It's hard to tell. I don't know. Either way, this creature here cannot wear the blue ribbon, so it's kind of irrelevant. So they, they can still be targeted, which kind of sucks. Uh, I rested so everyone can theoretically use all of their stuff, as far as I'm aware. And I believe our destination is not here. Thankfully, however, we have the option to let go, which I imagine is guaranteed, as opposed to run away, which isn't. But I, I, if I recall correctly, our destination is up here, somewhere. Abuse Highland Border. Hello. I talked to you from the wrong side, because I don't know how to walk. You feel like a spy or something romantic. Alright. If you take a shortcut through the woods. Alright. To the woods. Roger that, sir. Hmm. So at some point, it's just going to be me and Xiaoyi, I suspect, because I think we only have the two uniforms, which I was complaining about before. Let's go right. Maybe we shouldn't have gone right. There seems to be a lot of stuff over here. Let's see how difficult these are. Hot room. I meant unite. Let's do buddy attack, and then we'll just have everyone else do a standard attack. Alright, so those have quite a lot of defense. Also, when we level up, I'll point out something that I noticed on the level up screen. I don't know why it took me this long to notice it, but I did. Ooh, they do a lot of damage, too. Alrighty, so these are a bit scary. Let's see. I'll do a family attack on that one, I guess. Uh, do the Titan thing, I guess. I don't know. I think... Combat once only. I think this means she can only do it once per fight, but she can do it more times after that if she wants. I guess. We'll see. I've not actually used her ability yet, so I have no idea how it actually works. What I do know is these things hurt, and I wish they didn't. That one's dead, though, so all is well. Alright. Six damage. Six. And it blocked that, and then it beat the crap out of her again. How close to dead is she? Oh, it's dead, so it's kind of relevant, but... Wow, that XP. Alright. Clearly I should have just come here first and then run around to level. Let us heal you, because you're the only one that actually needs it, oddly enough. Hopefully those guys are short range so they don't wreck Tuta. Where are we going? Is this... What is this crap? Um, You know... I'm gonna do that. Everyone else can just attack. Can you do your rune thing again? She can, except it doesn't do any damage, so it's kind of irrelevant. 
You could also do a big attack, but I think we should save that. Even though we're gonna take a boatload of damage here. Unless they all die to this, because this might... I, well, not might, I suspect this is magic damage. Yeah, and they have no defense against that. Fair enough. Look at this XP, good lord. And the punch is good too. I was fighting this stuff out on the world map and I was like, this experience isn't really that good. It turns out, we should just go here. Um, I'd like to not keep using specials for this. We could keep using Titan, because they just use that for eternity. She has Earth, we don't want to use that. You have a thing that does no damage, and we may as well. Alright. If we can kill at least one of these without using a big special attack that I don't really want to use, I'll be happy. That is reasonable damage. She doesn't do any, because she has no strength. He or it, whatever it is. Should attack the top one. Four damage. Who's going to Well, at least we got a dodge, I suppose. And the reason I don't care much about him using Titan, by the way, is because he's already generally the last one to go because he's so slow. So the fact that Titan makes him go last anyway, I'm not too fussed about. She, however, goes first almost every single time. Well, actually, every single time, right? She's got crazy speed. I approve! One left. I don't think anyone's gonna hit it. No, we'll just auto it. It should die. Yeah. Unfortunate extra damage, but hey. Our new recruits have already caught up in level, which is nice. Oh, I forgot to show the thing. God dang it. I know the thing is very descriptive. Um, we won't heal them yet. Ricky Mara has crazy health. Can I do anything to his plants? No. Oh, a chest. A circurit. What in the heck is a circurit? Defense plus seven. Well, if anyone needs more defense, it would be her. She has no health, which to soak things. It's unfortunate that I bought a bunch of hats, but we have enough money for it anyway. How tough are you guys? Probably not as tough as the armadillos. Alright, so they have a good dodge chance. And a good counter chance, it seems. Can't dodge this, though. At least so far I haven't seen anything dodge it. Okay. They do good damage, and they dodge all of the things. They have decent health, too. Hmm. The enemies here scare me. Which is pretty much par for the course. Oh, nice. Okay, well, that works. Pretty much par for the course in RPGs, especially, like, a little bit after early game. Enemies start getting a little bit tougher, kind of rapidly. Anyway, on the, on the stat screen here, you might notice there's Strength, Magic, Defense, Magic, Tech, Speed, Luck. There's two magics. For whatever reason, instead of putting, you know, MDE or MDF, they put Madge. So, it's a thing. Uh, what it is, is it's Magic Defense, but I'm not sure why they put the exact same series of letters as Magic Attack, but whatever. They did, so it's horribly confusing. It confused me for a while until I realized what stat it actually was. Which admittedly didn't take very long, but hey, we're burning through some medicine here. Perhaps I shouldn't have sold off all of that excess medicine. This is what I get for doing things without realizing what happens. I don't know where I'm going. This is about par for the course, too. Good God! Alright, well... How many... You only have one more use of that. So we'll have you... Do you have any good items? Nope. You know what? Just attack. 
You attack, you may have items. His angry blow shouldn't actually help very much. Does nobody have the item I want? Apparently not. That only hits one person, so that's not very good. You, however, are going to do a thing for me. You're going to do that, and hopefully kill everyone. No, not shift. Yeah, apparently I don't have anyone with uh, attack items for whatever reason. I should probably fix that. Unless this just kills everyone, which it might. Eh, killed two of them. Admittedly, one of those died to instant death and not actually damage. Oh my lord. Well, I did see in the shop that there is an item to revive people. I think it's it's for unconscious status, but I think it's for reviving people. I assume that's what unconscious status is. Kind of sucks that she's not going to get this huge amount of XP. Ow. Really wasn't expecting her to just suddenly fall over and die, but that is kind of the problem. I'm going to keep calling it a her, even though I have no idea. I'm thinking it's a he. Considering it can't wear the stupid ribbon. A belt of strength. Also dead people. Can you, like, heal yourself or something? What is the point of this rune? I've never actually had the rune be useful. Uh, that'll do. Tuda needs more health. And more defense. More everything. Where are we and where are we going? I've probably missed so much treasure. Because I went right immediately and that was a huge, very long path. Actually, every path seems to be really long here. Oop. Apparently I found the way. No peeking. You people. If you're in danger, run away. I'm no coward. We will fight to the last. I don't know where it's taking me. Okay. We should go look in the tent with the provisions. It's probably that big tent over yonder. That doesn't really look all that much bigger than every other tent, but sure. Can I go into other tents? Because I'm going to. Uh, it's not going to let me. I want to steal their stuff. That looks like a commander's tent that I just ran by. Just do a quick exploration, see if there's anything here. Who are you? Hello. They're pure evil. You're right, I have no idea what I just hit there. We need butter! Thank you, kind sirs. Yes? I wish... I should really just stop speeding up text, but this is what I do in games that have text. I speed up the text because I read it fast. My apologies, and then I end up skipping dialogue choices. Which is unfortunate. I wish there was a delay on those. Where's the butter? You really should have taken some butter just in case, you know? Oh, hello. How's it going? Do we have to run? Oh, it's, it's actually gonna force me in this direction. Oh, okay. Where are we actually going though? Can I go in here? Nope. Alright, well I guess we're just gonna leave the... Oh. 
Which way are we supposed to be going then? Lord. Can we go north? Nope. It ran me this way. I keep getting stuck on the stupid tents. I go... Can't go that way. Can I open this? I can! Fire ceiling. I'm glad I actually ran back that way. I forgot about that treasure chest for a bit. Well, there's no other entrance or exit to this camp that I can see. Oh, we can go in this tent, huh? Hello, there appears to be a person there. Who are you? They've infiltrated the camp. I assure you, that's not necessary. Was that good enough, Mr. Spy? We have names, you know. What is she doing? I have a knife in my hand? He has a knife in his hand? Jowie, please. Must you threaten the princess with a knife? And once again, I went through dialogue choices and said I will someday. Also hit my desk. I can't help it. I gotta push buttons. We do know him. He's insane. He's a fiendish monster. You'd imagine a princess had some sort of power. The tea, by God. The tea was delicious. It is time to leave. We'll just walk out the front, apparently. I have. Are we really gonna walk out the front? Can I go in here now? Oh, for God's sake. Yeah, these guys have ter- oh no, never mind, I was gonna say they have terrible security. Oh, hello. Are we really in trouble? I mean... Are we really... I don't even think- we're, I, was, I was gonna use runes, but I don't think we even have to for these guys. We may be able to just get away with one of these attacks. No, we only killed the dude in the back. Well, we killed that one too. I was gonna do another Unite attack, but never mind. There we go. Mission accomplished. Good XP for that too. I wish I had the same magic stat as Jowie. He's got some crazy magic. I don't know why, but he does. 600 potch. Okay, see ya, or I can't do that. Uh, let's not leave Joey behind. Alright, well, apparently we have to leave Joey behind.
I've already used that rune multiple times. There's probably some sort of grave significance with the fact that he's calling upon that specific rune, but hey. Hello. Quick, murder them all! Oh yeah, we can't do the Fancy Pants Unite attack now. Hmm. Unfortunate. Do we have any other AoEs? Apart from his room? I don't think we do. Oh hey, we have Battle Oath now. 300 HP to all allies. That's crazy. We're gonna use that rune, which is probably going to just straight up kill all of them. We can't do the Unite thing to just hit stuff for free. That's unfortunate. And now we have no more AoEs at all. Oh. Tuda's health is finally getting up there. Shoulder pads! Oh yeah, I should check what that rune does. Should have done that earlier. Excuse me. Bit of a yawn there. I just woke up not too long ago, so... We have to go! Not on me, please. Is it going to take me back through the whole forest? Ah, it did. Good. Eh, he's probably dead. But apart from that, let's see what this rune does. Fire ceiling. Void fire, water damage times two. Interesting. What do you have to say? You're not allowed. Okay. <laughs> Fine. Jeez. Alright, back to Muse we go, I suppose. Minus one party member. I like that it's just basically a straight walk back here. It's my favorite. Most efficient walk. I mean, what should we do? I was already gonna go see Jess. You don't need to tell me to go see Jess. Or maybe you do. I don't know. I get easily lost. As demonstrated by already, I think, two whole videos of me being lost. Is he up here? No. Ah, there he is. Hello! Well, that's actually not him, but whatever. Uh... I was actually, I actually wanted to go around him, but, uh, okay. Have you seen the dude? Where's the dude? Look at that dude in the fancy clothing, really. So what's going on in this meeting? Ah, oh, he's in there. I want to go in there. Aww. I don't know who those other people are, but I want to be in there. So how do we get in there, then? Yeah, you guys don't say anything new. Nanami is just gonna continuously pop up, apparently, and explain to me the current trends. For some reason, I don't know. This was the next place I was gonna go, see if anyone's down here and talk to What's-Her-Face. Ah, they're here. Hello! Jowie's dead. I know where Jess is, he's in the room. Victor joins Convoy. And so does Flick. Flick is nowhere near as good as uh, Victor. Just a bit unfortunate, but whatever. I like how they actually joined before they walked over to us. How are you doing? Oh, okay. Fair enough, I guess. I was going to put someone in that sixth slot, but I don't know if we're going to be getting new members soon anyway, because there's those two fanc fancily dressed people in this room over here.
I think he just punched him in the face. That's a great trick. And I agree. Just walk up, punch him in the face, they'll run away. And who is Fitcher? Two weeks worth. I was just answering a question. Calm down, man. Hilltop Conference. Who is this Fitcher guy? Victor is so salty. I did agree to do it, you know. Calm down there. He probably killed everyone in the camp, if I'm gonna be honest here. He probably took the princess hostage and has turned insane. I don't know, maybe. Alright, well. Now what? I guess we could go out by the gate and see what's up. If anything... Ah, oh, hello. You'd be correct. Eh, I'll wait here with you. Staying with you. Oh, hi, Pelika. And Pelika's crying again. Poor Pelika. Do you remember the time I got lost everywhere, Nanami? Because apparently that's not just a problem for me, it's a problem for the character. Everybody gets lost. Hooray! And wait with you. How long does this go, I wonder? Far away from here. Where are we gonna go? Oh hey, it's a Jowie. How's it going? I'm not gonna hug you because that's just weird, but they will. I 
I'm tired from waiting. Eh, well, welcome home. We won't be that rude. Pelika still won't talk. One of these days, Pelika will say a single line. It's been a week? Good lord. What have we been doing for a week? Sleeping? Jouston Hill. Wasn't there some sort of hilltop conference? But it's already been two weeks. Maybe they're gonna attack the conference? Who knows? We don't need to adjust our party. Although maybe we should add people to the party, because it's just the three of us, but I don't know. I don't need to go there. How do I leave? <laughs> Is it there? Okay. I was confused. Leave me alone. What do you have to say? Uh, sure? You know the item store is actually not that far away from the gate, considering you got here. Anyone to face you? How much does she have to say? You interested in me? Maybe. She has a portrait. I want to recruit her. The game won't let me, though. What's the other old person have to say? Devil disguised in a suit of flesh. Okay, well, we can't put people in the party anyway. It's probably why we can't recruit her, maybe? I don't know. Maybe we can later. I've probably missed recruiting some people, I would imagine. I don't know. Oh, right, we need to go north. Yeah. Do I have to use the bathroom? I don't know. What are you on about? The bathroom's not outside the city, or maybe it is. I don't know. Is it this way to Justin? Ah, it is. The god has left. This is more mountain than hill, but what is this? Uh -uh. Hello! He doesn't even know the other one. Hooray! I don't want to explore the rest of the area, but... Proof of identity? You don't have any proof of identity, Victor. Good lord. That is Sir Flick. Hello. How could you not recognize his face? Look at it. It's beautiful. I guess it's not going to let me explore. It's just going to shove me in here. And I'm actually going to cut the video here. Bit of bit cliffhangery right as we get into this place, but it's been about 30 minutes. I'm going to cut the video here, and then we're immediately going to go see what this conference is about. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.